Hey everyone, so I know it has been so long since I posted a video on this channel, but it's like 11 o'clock at night and I literally like got home from work and I'm like, you know what, I'm going to post a video. So I threw some makeup on and then this happened. I like, we don't need to pay attention to that, but I decided to go ahead and film a video for you guys. Um, unfortunately, it's not going to be a makeup tutorial. It is just going to be my May favorites. I haven't done a favorites video, I think since January. So I decided why not go ahead and film a new one for you guys. Um, I have a ton, well not a ton, but I have a few things that I've been very, very like into this past month. And I would say that honestly, I really haven't spiced it up in the makeup department recently. I've kind of just been trying to use the stuff that I have. Um, I've tried out a couple new things, but I haven't done them like long enough to really do a review about it or put it in a favorites video. So I wanted to go ahead and show you guys um, the kind of like face and body products that I've really been loving for this past month. And so that's basically what this video is going to be. Um, so I'll just go ahead and get like the miscellaneous stuff out of the way and then we'll move into the other things. So first of all is a pair of sunglasses and you guys know if you've been on my channel for a while that I'm kind of obsessed with sunglasses. It's like that one thing that I just like can't pass up. So these were just sunglasses that I got at Forever 21. Um, they just look like this. And yes, I know they are not everyone's taste. They are a little bit big. And honestly, they're a little big for my taste because I prefer something with a little bit more shape. Um, however, lately, um, I have been like, as soon as I get home from work, I take my makeup off and I go around town without any makeup on. And so this covers up the fact that I don't have actual eyebrows. Um, so I have to like color them in. I do have eyebrows, they're just like super, super blonde. So I color them in, and when I don't want to color them in, I wear these because they cover my eyebrows, so necessity. As you guys know, or you may not know, Juicy Couture um, was sold, and so all the actual specialty stores are going to be closed. Um, they do currently have, I believe, 40% off of everything, whether it be online or in-store. So it's a pretty good deal. If you want to get some stuff, you better get it now because they are going to be closing. Um, I did hear that they're going to be sold in Kohl's, and I don't know if that's going to be like a Juicy Couture or um, buy Kohl's or what they're going to do with that, but I just know that that's where they're going to be sold. So the couple things, I've picked up a few things, quite a few things, but we don't need to get into that. Um, the stuff that I've been loving, however, is this bracelet here, and I may have actually shown this in a haul video, but this is just kind of like, it would be considered like a friendship bracelet, um, but I'm obsessed with it. I absolutely love it. I think it is a beautiful color, and I love the gold and the little diamonds here, so so pretty and I have been wearing it non-stop it's gorgeous and then also this um like wristlet it is also a wallet um I do have here's the thing I carry this in my purse um if I've been using it like the night before like if I go out and I use this I'll just toss it in my purse but I do actually have a wallet in my purse that has all of my other cards and business cards and things like that so this one is more of just like a necessities. Um, as you can see, it's pretty empty right now because I did um, kind of, I haven't really like switched everything over into this and I took some stuff out of it the other day. So it just looks like this. Um, it has the Juicy Couture uh, in the inside. And the coolest thing about this, and I wish I had my phone near me, but the reason, like the main reason I got this is this pocket here, even though it's for like the iPhone 4S 5 type thing, it actually fits my Android. So very exciting. I thought that was super awesome. Um, I haven't quite figured out what this pocket here is for, like this right here, because you can stick your finger in it. And I'm wondering if it's for like headphones. I don't know. If you guys know, let me know um, because I would really be interested in knowing what to put in that pocket. And then, of course, you can fold this little guy um, into the wallet and just kind of make it a clutch. So really love that. It just has the little snap closure and I'm obsessed with it. My mom loves it and so I'm like on the hunt to get her one. Um, yeah, so they're awesome. Really, really love them. So if you see one at your store, definitely pick it up because I think it's such a good product. But enough about that. I raved too much about Juicy Couture. Just, oh, can't believe they're closing. Anyway, so now on to like the face and body products. And recently, I don't know what it is, but I've been super into like my skincare and like taking like lotion and all this kind of stuff, like really taking good care of my skin. Um, and I think it's just because I've been working so much and I feel like my skin has been neglected a little bit. So this past... I can't even talk. This past month, I've been super into like skincare. So the first thing, not really skincare, but it is a body type product, and it's this deodorant. Um, it was a dollar ninety eight because I guess it was on clearance. It was marked down. There was a ton of them, and I only picked one up because I'm like, dude, I need deodorant. Let me just grab this real quick, and there you go. This has actually turned into probably one of my favorite deodorants of all time. It smells really good. It's just the rainforest mist. So I think they are discontinuing it, which is sad. But it was a dollar ninety eight. 
$2 well spent, let me tell you. Moving on to face care. Um, these Biore pore strips, everybody knows about them. They've been around for a while. We've all used them. These ones are the ultra deep cleansing. And the only bad thing about these is it only comes with six as opposed to, I think it's usually eight or 12, which is fine though. Um, only because these right here, I feel like these, the deep cleansing, really get more of like that dirt and like blackheads than the original ones do. So it really does kind of live up to the ultra deep cleansing. And I guess if they're only going to give you six, it's still worth it because it, to, in my opinion, it does work better than the other ones. So I've been loving, loving those. And I just, I love the pore strips in general because I just think they work really well for my skin. And then also, um, I'm also going to be doing a like entire face routine and what I use on my face, you know, washes, scrubs, all that kind of stuff. Um, I don't know if you guys would be interested in that because I do have like acne prone skin. I have acne right now. You just can't tell because these lights are so bright. Um, I have acne prone skin. My skin gets very dry, but it also gets very oily. So it is a combination. So if you guys would be interested in an updated skincare routine, definitely let me know. Um, because I'm not showing all of the skincare products in this video that I've been obsessing over the past month. This little guy here, which this is the Clean and Clear Night Relaxing Deep Cleansing Face Wash. And it is oil free, which is perfect for what I look for in any kind of face wash because I'm already oily. I really don't need more oils put on my skin and also I find that products um, like face cleaning products that do have oil in them whether it be like a makeup remover or anything tends to break my skin out more. I just it doesn't do very well with it. So I like this. Um, this is actually, it has sea minerals and sea kelp extract in it. So I'm assuming that's what helps with the kind of um, relaxing skin properties. So I've been really loving it. I think it's really, really nice. Ever since I discontinued the, um, what is it called? I forget what it's called. Oh, the Clear Sill like night face wash, which that was holy girl product. Oh my gosh, never saw my face so clear in my life. They discontinued it. I can't find it anywhere. So I did go ahead and go with this guy. So on to like body care. Well, actually, let's do some hair stuff first. Um, first thing is actually just like an item, and it is the Tangle Teaser. I like totally jumped on the bandwagon of these. I don't even know, like months ago, and I have been obsessed. I no longer use an actual brush. I only use this guy. Sometimes I will say if I'm like brushing or if I'm doing this, like I will throw it by accident because it just kind of like slips out of your hand. That's the only downfall. Okay, and then along with hair stuff, I only brought the shampoo in here because the conditioner, the bottle was still wet and I really didn't want to bring it in here. But it is this shampoo and conditioner set here. This is the L'Oreal Paris Advanced Hair Care. This is for the Total Repair 5 Restoring Shampoo. So this right here um, basically claims that it instantly and over time helps repair the five visible signs of damaged hair without wearing it down. Um... So I've been trying this out. It's about halfway now and I would say it's definitely been working or at least I've seen a visible difference in my hair. Um, it took about a month for me to notice it. I don't think it really acts as instantly as it claims on the bottle um, but about a month and I did start to notice my hair. Just the texture of it in general was a lot softer. It didn't feel as brittle. Um, yeah, I do use a lot of heat on my hair all the time, which I have been really trying to like kind of cut back a little bit. But I feel like that that product's really been helping, which is so nice. And the, it smells really good as well. The last and final products that I wanted to show you guys are actually in a little set. And during uh, Victoria's Secret... Um, the, it was like a buy two get one free sale on body care that they had and I'm so sorry my chair keeps squeaking but I keep like fidgeting because I haven't filmed a video in forever and so I'm just kind of like trying to like focus and not move around a whole lot. Oh well. Um, so yeah, so Victoria's Secret, they had a buy two get one free for body beauty care, um, like the fragrance and mist lotions and all that good stuff. So this was about two months ago and I've been using it nonstop ever since. So the first thing is this is the Lost in Love. That's the collection I'm showing you guys and this is from the Pink Collection. Um, this smells like coconuts. It's delicious. And I'm trying to see what it has in it because I never actually looked before. I don't know. It doesn't say but I'm telling you guys it smells like coconuts and I love it. Oh, it smells so good. So good, I'm telling you. Ooh, but I absolutely love it. So this is a lotion. Um, it did not come, I don't think it came in a smaller bottle. This was the only bottle size that they had. Absolutely love it. Like I said, I put it on right after I get out of the shower. And then in the shower, I've actually been using this right here, which is the Lost in Love Body Scrub. This is the two-in-one wash and scrub. So it's a body scrub, whatever. Again, has that nice coconut smell. It just looks like this. It is a very, like, 
it, when you like when you take the cap off and you look at the product it looks kind of like a very like gooey but as soon as you kind of rub it on oh my gosh it, like your skin just feels amazing it's just oh, perfect i love this product so 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 much and then a first for my channel can we just like take a moment of silence for a second and drink in the fact that i actually tried self tanner Okay, moment of silence is up. I tried self-tanner. I can't believe I tried it. Like, just what is life right now? I've never self-tanned before. Never been in a tanning bed. Never done a spray tan. Never self-tanned before. Ever. In my lifetime. So, I finally went ahead and I got this because it was part of the sale. And I honestly, they didn't have anything else in the collection that I really liked. And I already had the fragrance mist from a different purchase. So, I went ahead and just got this guy. Um, and it looks so dark. If you guys can see that, it looks so, so, so dark in the bottle. Um, but once I, once you apply it and really like blend it out and get it all over, it actually, after it develops, it develops into a really, really nice tan. So for my first time trying self-tanner, I think that this was a pretty decent product. Um, it worked really well and I really liked it. I thought it gave my legs a really nice tan. However, I did notice that, um, if I put like too much of it on, obviously I'm not a pro at self-tanner and I did get it some really like splotchy areas. There's like a hair Ugh. Anyways, I did have some pretty splotchy areas like on my feet and my ankles, but I got that scrubbed off. That was really nice. Um, but I will say, after like the second day of putting it on, I think maybe I put too much on and I did start to look a little bit orange. So I would say a little bit goes a long way with this. It does develop into a really nice tan. So love that. However, I really feel like that I'd like to try like one of the foaming ones. Maybe not the Saint Tropez only because it's really expensive. But some kind of foaming. I don't know. We'll see. If you guys have a recommendation, leave them below for me definitely. So that was my favorites for the month of May. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry it was kind of long winded. Um, but I didn't have a ton of products. But the products I did have I really wanted to tell you guys about and kind of like give you my full experience or opinion on. So I hope you guys don't mind that. Um, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for sticking around on my channel. I apologize that I have not been making videos. You guys know if you've watched my um, couple recent videos, well most recent, um, that I, I do have two jobs. I work really hard. Um, also, you know, I have a personal life I gotta take care of. So, you know, it's just kind of hard for me to get time to film. But I really, I keep up with YouTube. I do keep up with, you know, comments on my videos and stuff. And I'm always, always looking at you guys' videos and up to date on all my, you know, what's in my subscription feed and everything. So I do take time to do that. Like if I'm laying in bed or something before I go to sleep, I just really haven't had any time to film. And my background right now is hideous. Like my room is such a disaster. <sighs> Juicy Couture bag, like, there, right there is some, like, guilt sitting in a bag. Like, just, we won't talk about that. Anyways, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you again so much for watching, and I cannot wait to make another video for you guys. I have a ton of summer idea videos. It's just a matter of me trying to, like, execute them and really finding the right time I guess or finding the time to film them so I hope you guys enjoyed um I'll also be doing kind of like a life update video probably gonna film this after that after this video um since I have some time so I will just go ahead and cut this off now I love you guys thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you in my next video bye